Please subscribe to Let Share Solutions and press the bell icon for daily life transforming videos. How many things can you do at one time? Okay, let me give you an example. Do you see all these videos? Now I want you to this video. Learn from this video. Every day, because now I am giving you knowledge, more knowledge, and less time. Maybe why don't you watch and all these videos that are also helpful for? What happened? You didn't like the idea. I was trying to give you all the knowledge, uh, all the videos together in just uh, less time, more knowledge. Isn't it good? Now you would be thinking that what a stupid idea. You can only watch one video at a time. You can only learn one thing at a time. You only have one mind. Two eyes, but you see the same thing. You cannot see two different things. And that's what the message is for today's video. I share with you a very interesting story. It's a very old story. You might have heard it already a lot of times. If you haven't, I would love to share this with you. It's a story of uh, uh, Arjuna. Arjuna was uh, a very a great uh, archer, one of the best archer uh, in Mahabharata. And he had a guru, Dronacharya. Dronacharya was one of the best teacher at that time. So a lot of students complained that Dronacharya was biased towards Arjuna and uh, they said they used to complain about it so it's okay uh, Dronacharya said okay let's do a small test and I'll I'll see uh, who succeeds I will that that student will become my favorite student so okay so he made a wooden uh, wooden bird and kept it on a tree and then he said we'll do an archery test and any uh, student who hits the uh, bird's eye will be the winner. So first came Yudhishthir. And Dronacharya, the guru, he asked that, uh, Okay, Yudhishthir, what do you see? He said, I can see the tree. I can see the clouds. I can see uh, all the, the river next to it. I can see everything. He said, Okay hit the target. So he hit the target and uh, he failed. And then came Ashwatthama. And then uh, the teacher, the guru, he asked, okay, what do you see? He said, I not only see the tree and the river, I also see uh, the leaves of the tree. I can see all the details. I can see so many things. So... The guru said, okay, very good, hit the target. So he hit the target and he also failed. And then came Arjuna. And then Dronacharya asked him, okay, Arjuna, what do you see? And he looked at the bird's eye and said, I only see the bird's eye. So the guru said, no, no, what else do you see? Do you see? Because he was trying to test him. He said, okay, what else do you see? There are so many things out there. He said, no, sir. I only see the bird's eye. So what does this story tell us? Okay, obviously what happens is that he said hit the target and Arjuna hits the target and he successfully hits the bird's eye. So the message here is that why he was the best or the favorite student why he was considered the best archer at that time because of his focus he only saw what is there that he has to hit and nothing else in today's world just like they had so many distractions the tree and the birds and other birds and all the things in today's world we have so many distractions and we want to gain all the knowledge all the information we want to do a lot of things together but success, the true success, happens only if you focus on one thing that you want to do. Stop looking for uh, doing more things. Do one thing and do it with full concentration. I would like to tell you some amazing things which will happen with you when you start practicing one thing at one time. At any given point of time, 
all you have to think is what is the most important thing that I have to do right now? Or what is the only thing that I've decided to do right now? Do it with full focus. When you do this, that is meditation. Meditation is not sitting like this, closing your eyes and doing nothing. That's a big misunderstanding about meditation. Meditation is not doing nothing. It happens through focus. Why we close our eyes, why we speak mantras and all these things, you know, I will tell you some strategies sometimes in future videos also that do this method, speak this mantra. But that's not meditation. That's just a way so that you get into meditation so that you get like if you open your eyes, there are so many things that you get distracted from. But when you close your eyes, all these things disappear. That helps you in meditation. That is not meditation. So what you need to do is that if you do one thing at a time, I'm not talking about meditation right now. I'm talking about doing things, anything. It could be playing with your kids or it could be driving a car. It could be uh, watching a movie, watching this video. It could be studying or doing anything, doing your work. Whatever that you do, if you do one thing at one time, you're not doing anything else, only that thing at, the, at that time, that is meditation. You will not only be stress-free at that time, you will also feel the joy. And this joy cannot be explained in words. When you do just one thing at a time, nothing else, one thing, you get a real joy. And it's, it's such a nice feeling. Unfortunately, we miss it because we want to do a lot of things. And also, when we do a lot of things, we do not get the results that we want. If we focus on one thing and complete focus is on that one thing, we can get more results. It's a very big misunderstanding. It's, it's, a, it's a wrong belief. People do not believe it. And I'm not an expert in it. I also used to do a lot of things. And then I learned this. And now I only do one thing at a time. And I'm able to do more. My results are more now. So that's what I want to share with you. I wish you all the best for more videos on meditation and spirituality. Watch the complete playlist and I'll see you in the next video.